bar tour and we're going for a five hour bus cruise cruise. I'll show you. So I'm not sure where I'm not sure where we're heading to, but it's called Bus Cruise Tour. Golden Horn and I don't know, we're going to a palace as well for an hour. Bye bye Istanbul, Istanbul, adios. <laughs> The guide is trying to explain. I hope you can understand why it is. By that time, it used to be an official golden school for the very first time criminals who used to be in the city. It's good that it's not too wavy. The second edition of the film works as a museum. The water is so calm. You can see a museum where it has submarine, train, an airplane in there. I didn't get the name, I'm sorry. But you can Google it, I guess. To give you more information about this tour, so it costs 11 euros. And we have two stops that mentioned earlier. For five hour cruise, and there's another offer as well where it is um, one stop for 10 euros. I think it's three hours. So, hopefully, we can stop by where there is like a good lunch. Um, one stop, I believe, is for on a fortress, and the other one is on a path. I like that boat style. Look. residential park that we're going through. I like it, it's very colorful. You can see a cable car. Of course it brings you to the top. And then say there was a cafe on the top. As you can see under the bridge there are restaurants. Oh, that's Galata in Balik. I've heard they've got this the best fishes menu in. Which it's has the biggest chandelier in the whole world as it's oh. around four and a half tons. And this is also where the ex-Turkish president Mustafa Kemal Atatürk used to live. In 1930, did you hear that? So this palace, the biggest chandelier in the world. I recently it works every single day from nine o'clock in the morning till five afternoon, except once again for passing by Dumna Chakcha. Dumna Chakcha Palace. If I heard it right. And if I pronounce it right. <laughs> Doom that Four Seasons Hotel. For not so rich people. <laughs> I don't know if I can really afford it one day. <laughs> so another palace, it's called Chiran Palace. It's quite big. that time it has become a hotel known as Recently, it is considered one of the most expensive hotels here in the city because the minimum price. Oh, and it has hotels as well, and what, it's one of the most Thailand. expensive hotels. Yeah. After the deluxe <laughs> golden horn. <laughs> one of the most expensive hotels here in the city. Portico. Some residential houses close to the Look at me like that. This is the view of Romali. 
Oh my god, so I climb up from, of course, from the bottom to up here and we're going to climb up there. I'm so tired. Nice view. I made it to the peak. Look. Oh my god, I'm still catching my breath. Oops. It's no longer allowed to go up to the tower. It's yet uh, here in Tur Turkey you will see a lot of um, stray cats. Oh my god, I hope you want to come closer to me. This is the first military school in the city. This is Bayberry Palace. It's 40 lats. So 40 lira. 40 lira to get in. And if you just want to see their garden, to get into the garden, it's 5 lira. Okay? So we don't actually have 40 lira, so we just stay here in the garden. <laughs> oh boy. Okay. okay. So this is the palace we went to earlier. Now you're so bad. There it is. The palace that we went to earlier. Bye bye palace. I said goodbye. Thank <laughs> you. 